Hey guys, want to review today a quick one on this EVL 908 charger. This is sent to me by the Smoking Ape. He uh, was doing a review on this for his channel, and I kind of made a comment about it, and he's like, hey, check it out. So, I've been playing with this thing for a couple of weeks now, and finally getting around to making the video. Now, this is not not a bad little charger at all, actually. I, I really like, number one, that it's inexpensive, and number two, that it's readily available on Amazon. The EBL brand seems to be very popular on Amazon. And not only that, but some of these chargers have two and 3,000 reviews, and most of them are four and five stars. But as a gear reviewer, I'm often a skeptic and don't tend to trust reviews because I know that sometimes people tend to give bad reviews for products because they just don't know how to use them, and other times people tend to give good reviews and they just don't know enough to know any better, that there's better stuff out there. So I'm, I'm, I'm a terrible skeptic when it comes to this stuff. But what you got here is a nice little four bay charger that can do double A's, triple A's, nine volts, C and D's. It can only charge, I think, two nine volts, so. And it's a two amp charger, so that is, of course, split up amongst the bays. And it also has two one amp USB ports on the side here for charging electronics like cell phones and all that. And it is also a smart charger, which is very important, guys. A lot of cheap chargers on the market, they don't charge based on when the battery's full, they just literally set a timer and they're assuming the battery's empty and it just charges for, say, like four hours and then shuts off. Which is really bad because if you put a battery on there that's, say, half empty, you're going to have like two hours of it just trying to charge. This doesn't do that. This, when it reaches that full capacity, it turns on to a trickle charge and just keeps it topped off. That's a really important thing when it comes to keeping your batteries healthy for long term. And it is a big killer is that heat that's generated from overcharging. So with a charger like this, you're not going to have that problem. As you can see, there's a little LCD display here on the side, which tells you the uh, charge that, char <laughs> tongue tied already, uh, charging status of each bay. And you can also mix and match. You don't have to do, we have four C's in here charging up. You don't have to do that. You can mix and match A's, triple A's, and all that. So that is kind of cool as well. Some chargers just don't allow you to do that. You have to put in a certain amount or you have to fill up every bay. No, this one's a smart charger. It can handle it, which is kind of cool. And a big preference to have something that actually works like that. That's not going to ruin your investment. Let's face it, rechargeable batteries are expensive. So like I said, it's a two amp charger. So that is going to be split up amongst its bays. And overall, guys, very happy with it. It's, uh, I think, a good little charger for the money, especially if you're only using nickel metal hydrides. It's not going to do your lithium ions or any of the other fancy uh, batteries out there. But if you're just looking for a plain, simple rechargeable with uh, nothing to confuse you, nothing to uh, screw up, it's a good choice. And these EBL brands seem to be pretty good for the money. And uh, the good reviews on Amazon, I think, are, are kind of well-deserved. Is it the best out there? No. Is it the most fully featured? No. But is it a good charger at a good price? And you can also get it on Amazon? Yes. And that's what makes it really good. That availability on Amazon really does help out and make things a lot more accessible to us. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, once again, thanks to Smoking Ape for sending this over for me to check out.